Right, how we doing folks? Rich Van Tassel with you. Today is Monday, November 20th, 2017. We've got to give you the preview of tonight's game between the Seattle Seahawks and the Atlanta Falcons. Uh, Seattle is the home team. They're six and three, three and one at home. Atlanta is five and four, three and two on the road. Injuries for the visiting Falcons. Devontae Freeman, running back, is out. Matt Bosher, punter, Duke Riley, linebacker, are questionable for the Seahawks. Dwayne Brown, tackle, Jern Reed, defensive tackle, are questionable. Cam Chancellor, safety is out. He's likely done for the season. Luke Jocko Gord, Michael Wilhoy, linebacker. You're looking at the quarterback play, and probably most people wouldn't have expected that Russell Wilson would come into the year playing better in this game. Now, Wilson has a few more incompletions than Matt Ryan. He has more yards, more touchdowns, and fewer interceptions, however. Russell Wilson has been asked to do a lot because that running game has been inconsistent. He is their leading rusher as well. So that is a case where... Excuse me. All right, sorry about that. So that is a case where he's become their top rusher also, so that forces him to pass the ball a lot, forces him to find the receivers, and really that offensive line play has not been good. Russell Wilson is having a great season. There's really no two ways about it. Matt Ryan uh, got off to a good start. They had struggled a bit. Now he's starting to come on again, however, and that is... This is an interesting game here because he's got that secondary without Cam Chancellor. They're going on the road. I don't know how Atlanta is going to approach this game if they're going to try to run the ball. They don't have Devontae Freeman, so it's a it's a wounded team, a weak team as far as injury-wise when I say weak in this situation. So I, really do, uh, I think a lot's going to be placed on Matt Ryan, but I don't know how effective he can be. Look for them to try to stretch the secondary of C of Seattle out. Uh, you know, try to find the weaknesses by when you get deeper into the roster. Look for guys like Mohamed Sanu to have a big game. And I think Atlanta's going to go on the road and get it. I don't trust Seattle that much. I don't trust the running game as much as I like Russell Wilson. I think Atlanta has started to right the ship again. They had that victory against the Cowboys, and they're going to move forward and be able to get the victory in this one. I like a score of 28-24 to 24 over the Seattle Seahawks. All right, when this game goes final tonight, we'll give you the recap of it. Be sure to stay tuned. In a few minutes, we're going to give you the weekly NBA report. Thank you.